Now it's time for Tech Talk. But don't you just hate it when people who never speak to you on WhatsApp but are the first people to watch your statuses and ask you to send every time. Please send me your status or LOL, please send me your status, your WhatsApp status. Well, Spikey has come to our rescue. Spikey, what's up? How can Hi. you save me from these people? Oh, I get that a lot, Maps. Every uh -huh. single time I post something on my status, people hit me up and say, Hey, Spikey, I want that. Yeah. Could you send me that video? And when I decide to teach them how to do it, they're like, you know, you could just send it to me, right? But they don't know it's a lot of work for you to also go into your gallery, find it, and then send it to them. And again. also a lot of data. Exactly. A lot of data. you're sending it again. Yeah. Meanwhile, it's already downloaded on their devices. Mm -hmm. So if you're watching this and you're one of those people, there's an app called ES File Explorer or any file explorer in the Play Store. Mm -hmm. I prefer ES File Explorer because of the features it has. When you go into your ES File Explorer, there's a menu bar to the top left. When you hit it, come straight down. You see show hidden files. It's, de it's disabled by default okay. because they don't want you going to tamper with the system files. Mm -hmm. So just turn it on and it allows you to see all your system files. So you see some of these files were actually hidden, but now I can see them. So when you go into your WhatsApp folder, yes. and you go into your media folder, you'll see a folder called dot statuses. Mm -hmm. That's every single status that you viewed, because I haven't viewed any status here, you wouldn't see it. Okay. But every single status you viewed would be in this folder. Mm -hmm. If you have a different file manager, it would be the same thing. You go into your files, your device storage, mm -hmm. WhatsApp, folder and then the media and you'll see dot statuses okay so it what's the file what's the acronym again es file explorer so es file explorer yeah it's in the play store uh -huh. you download it and then you open you can use it to do other things but mm -hmm. today we're just using it to download whatsapp, WhatsApp statuses. statuses so you don't bother people hey send me that status hey send me that status really? okay so you know the question i always ask you you know the, the question i always ask you yeah. can iphone users can iphone users use it Unfortunately, iPhone users cannot use it. iPhone users, if you want to download states, you don't have to download it. Just record, record your screen. Yeah. We spoke about this, but like it's, we spoke about this. I, like, I don't know. You know, it's, I don't want to record it. I want to download it because with the recording, you'll get the icons showing you that you were recording. It's just a lot of work for me. Do you understand? Okay, so. I just want the video itself. You know, when you're done recording it, you can actually edit it before you send it. Spiky so the process of sending it, you are allowed to trim the video, okay. the beginning and the end. So you can take out the beginning where you were initiating the recording okay. and take out the end where you were cutting right. off the recording. Also, you could, once again, get a video editor that can crop to the actual parts of the screen that you just want, and then you're done. So you're telling me as an iPhone user, I need to find an editor. Yeah, you I need, need a video trim editor. A video editor. So I need to trim my videos from beginning to end. Like, so I can't get, there's no app for us. Um, I mean, the elite needs to have an app for something. They'll, I'm sure some, but you know, uh -huh. because Apple, Apple applications usually work in sandboxes, it's uh -huh. very difficult to get an application that, can you know, can communicate with another application. Okay. So unfortunately, this is how you're going to... If that was working, well, if you jailbreak your phone, you can do this. Okay. But once again, I'm not one to condone illegal stuff. Mm -hmm. Illegal in quotes, yes. because you can still do it. All right, so run us to. through the app one more time. So you download ES File Explorer, mm -hmm. and then you go to the menu, scroll down to the bottom, you'll see Show Hidden Files, Enable It. Mm -hmm. Once you enable it, you go into your File Explorer, into my internal storage because that's where I have my WhatsApp. Uh -huh. Open the WhatsApp folder, go to media, yeah. you'll see dot statuses. If hidden files is, show hidden files is off, it won't show. Okay. So you see it's gone. But the moment I turn it on, mm -hmm. voila, it's back. That's you open bad. it and all your statuses will be there. Viewed statuses. So it means that the ones that you've actually watched okay. and they've downloaded, they'll be here. I haven't viewed any statuses here, uh -huh. so it wouldn't show here. But that's going to be very tricky because now you're getting to people's personal lives. I so didn't you've got ask someone's them to video. share it. You say? They share their statuses and I watch them. So it's on my device now. It's their fault for sharing it and it's their fault for letting it stay on my device. I, I mean, I don't even want it to be on my device anyway. So this is a way for you to also delete unwanted stuff. Although after 24 hours, WhatsApp deleted. But 
if mm. you want to free space, uh -huh. you can actually go to this folder and delete the, the status that have been downloaded. Or just don't watch them at all. All right. <laughs> so at the receiving end, uh, am I able to block you from getting my statuses? Why would you want to do that? No, from saving them onto your phone. I don't want you to be saving my, you know, my party statuses. No. And don't share them. Because once you share them, it's going to be on the device. But you can choose the people that you want to save, like to see your status. But once you share it, and then anyone sees it, once you share it with me, uh -huh. I'm privy to downloading it. It's going to be there. So now the only problem is that I don't know who's got the app. So I don't know who I can Oh, there's block. another... There's a, there's, a, there's a different kind of WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. I'm sure those, uh, the crooks, quote unquote, <laughs> know it. Yeah. It's called GB WhatsApp. There's WhatsApp Plus. All these forked versions of WhatsApp, they actually have a download button in the status bar. So when you're watching a status, you can actually hit the option and download it. Okay. But it's not an official WhatsApp. So if you're getting it from somewhere, it could actually come with certain bugs and certain stuff. So if you, do, if you don't trust it, don't do it. Don't use it. Okay, okay. Makes sense. Okay. But if you're daring, like me, why not? <laughs> why not? All right. So thank you so much, Spiky, for that tech talk. You're welcome. See you next Wednesday Definitely. for some more and interesting tech talks. But from the Draw News Interactive team, it's been a wonderful Wednesday. Thank you so much for tuning in. You remember, you can catch us on DSTV Channel 421 and Go TV Channel 144. Same time, same place tomorrow. Adios. Thank you.